Hey guys, this is a helpful video for those people that bought the Galaxy S10 Plus but accidentally played around with Bixby and changed the language settings to Chinese. So once you do that, you, it's, you're going to have a hard time getting back if you don't need Chinese characters. Now instead of calling my Chinese friends to help me translate, and um, I played around and I figured it out, but you shouldn't be playing around because you might press buttons that you shouldn't be pressing. But the way to do that, to get it back to English or to whatever native language you were speaking, you could press these three buttons right here in the top right hand corner and you get a selection of five items. Now choose the fourth item and then it'll take you another menu. Then choose the very first item, which is languages. And then you have to select the top button once more and voila, there you go. Now you can change it back to English or whatever language you're speaking. Um, I'm going to play around with this a little more experiment. So I'm going to do English United Kingdom and let's try Amy. Hi, my name is Bixby. So that's how you do it. And now I could read and I could play around with this Bixby. But by the way, I use I use Google Assistant um, for my daily driver. But, you know, it's good to know these things and it's good to play around with Bixby and see what she could do.